today we're in the kitchen with registered dietitians Angela Gervais and Tia Fio from the Mountain Home VA Healthcare System Move Weight Management Program for Veterans. That's a mouthful right there in itself. Angela and Tia, what have you brought for us today? Well, it's really great to be here. Yeah. Thank you for um, having us. Yeah, thank you so much for uh, having us. I'm so, I'm so glad you all are here. And we're talking about, you know, this MOVE program and eating healthier. And this is a great way to have a great winter, fall kind of a dish, chili, but do it with a little a little twist to it. Talk I to certainly us about agree. It. Yeah. I certainly agree. So we brought two recipes okay. uh, this time for you. The first one is a butternut squash chili. Okay. So this one's going to be perfect as things are getting colder outside. This is going to warm up our belly and really spice up uh, the upcoming season. So the main ingredient, as you know, is going to be butternut right uh, squash. So a lot of times when we go to the store mm -hmm. and we see this, we you know can get pretty intimidated by it. Right. We're not really sure necessarily what to do with it. So I'm going to show you all how simple this can really be. Um, so we already have our butternut squash with the ends chopped off and right. then I've also um, cut it down the center as well. Um, so really the first thing that you can do is you just take your vegetable peeler and just like you would a carrot, take off the outside layer of it. So. Sometimes that can be a little rough. Sometimes and it can be. Got to put a little muscle in there. <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> now when you, once you get it peeled, mm -hmm. it, it, what is the next step going to be? Because I know so, that you you're, you're going to cube. You brought the actual cube to the frozen. Here is we have. If you can't go that way, this is a great time saver right here. So it is. So the frozen is something that you can purchase um, in the store. Now it's mm -hmm. going to be found in your organic section right. more than likely. So it can be a little bit difficult to find, um, and it can be used as a shortcut, especially if you're a busy um, person at home who maybe doesn't have a lot of time to peel and right. chop up this. Now on the inside, there are also some seeds, mm -hmm. very similar to what you would find inside of like a pumpkin. Right. I'm gonna turn it over to Angela and let her tell us what you could do with the seeds. So yeah, you just uh, scoop those out and something you could do with those seeds, just like with pumpkin seeds, you can um, rinse them off right. and remove all those strings, um, toss them in a little olive oil and put them in the oven with your favorite seasoning all over them. Roast um, them. Roast them. Mm -hmm. It takes about 20 minutes or so until they're golden. Um, they're a great source of mono uh, unsaturated fats and so they're really good for you. And better so than that's squash. Really good for you oh, as yeah. well. Yes. So, Vitamin A. Oh yeah. Good for your Chock full of good stuff for mm -hmm. you there. Yeah. All right. So we're we're going to go with the frozen, and we already in the pan. Tell us what we got in the pan going. So, so already in the pan, we have uh, two tablespoons of olive oil, okay. and then we've added in some onions. And I know you all at home can't smell this, but <laughs> it smells delightful. It's Everyone going, has commented. It's going all the way down the hallway it through is. the building. It is a, it it's is. a really good smell. Okay. So what do we got going in next? So we've cooked these down until the onions are translucent. Right. So we can see right through them. The next thing we're going to do is add in some red peppers and we're just going to stir those in until they get just a little bit soft. Okay. Okay, so continuing to stir. I'll stir that. Thank you so much. You're Chris. welcome. Glad and to do it. And then next we're going to add in a little bit of garlic. So garlic, of course, is really great for things like blood pressure mm -hmm. and overall heart health. Certainly it's packed full of some and of that good stuff. And it also makes things taste extremely good. It so. does and <laughs> smell good too. So we're going to have even oh, more man. people knock mm. it down our door. Oh. Oh man, that's like a really good spot treatment too. Yeah, <laughs> I think so. I think great. so. So we got a few more seconds here. So we're going to put. Let's. Uh, what do we got going in next? We got the uh, butternut. So this going is in? the butternut squash okay. that is frozen. So okay. this is going to go in next. And all we would do is cook this down until uh, it just gets a little bit soft. Okay. Well, we're going to finish this up and come back in a few moments because you have another recipe you want to share with us. Today. Certainly. It's got coconuts and dates and it's going to be delicious because I love both of those things. But if you want to find out more about the MOVE program, we're going to talk about that as well coming yeah. up a little later. But there's some information right there at the bottom of the screen to help you get involved with MOVE as well.